Welcome to TLE Exploratory 7 and 8. For today's lesson, we will tackle the agriculture and crop production. For lesson 1, we have used farm tools and equipment. Hand tools. Hand tools are usually light and are used without the help of animals or machines. They are being used in performing farm activities, which is involves small areas like school, garden, and home garden. Under hand tools, we have bolo. It's used for cutting tall grasses and weeds and chopping branches of trees. Crowbar is used for digging big holes and for digging out big stones and stumps. Pick mattock is used for digging canals, breaking hard topsoil and for digging up stones and tree stumps. Grab hoe is used for breaking hard topsoil and pulverizing soil. Spade is used for removing trash or soil Digging canals or ditches and mixing soil media. Shovel is used in removing trash, digging loose soil, moving soil from one place to another and for mixing soil media. Rake is used for cleaning the ground and leveling the topsoil. Spading fork is used for loosening the soil, digging out root crops and turning over the materials in a compost heap. Light hoe is used for loosening and leveling soil and digging out furrows for planting. Hand trowel is used for loosening the soil around the growing plants and putting small amount of manure fertilizer in the soil. Hand cultivator is used for cultivating the garden plot by loosening the soil and removing weeds around the plant. Hand fork it's used for inter-row cultivation. Pruning shears. For cutting branches of planting materials and unnecessary branches of plants. Axe. is for cutting bigger size paws. Knife. is for cutting planting materials and for performing other operations in horticulture. Sprinklers. Watering seedlings and young plants. Water pails for hauling water, manure, and fertilizers. Sprayers are for spraying insecticides, foliar fertilizers, fungicides, and herbicides. Wheelbarrow is used for hauling trash, manures, fertilizers, planting materials, and other equipment. Sickle is a handheld agricultural tool with a variously curved blade typically used for cutting weeds. Now, let us proceed for farm implements. These are accessories which are being pulled by working animals or mounted to machineries like hand tractor or tractor, which are usually used in the preparation of land. These are usually made of special kind of metal. First, we have plows. These are farm implements either pulled by a working animal or a tractor. The plow is specifically used for tilling large areas, making furrows and inter-row cultivation. So we have native plow and this plow. Next, harrow. The native wooden harrow is made of wood with metal teeth and pulled by a carabao while the this harrow is made of metal mounted to a tractor. Harrows are used for tilling and pulverizing the soil. Rotavator The rotavator is an implement mounted to a tractor used for tilling and pulverizing the soil. And lastly, we have the common farm equipment. These are machineries used in a crop production. They are used in land preparation and in transporting farm inputs and products. This equipment need a highly skilled operator to use. First, we have hand tractor. It's used to pull a flow and harrow in preparing a large area of land. 
four-wheel tractor is used to pull this flow and this harrow in preparing much bigger area of land. Water pumps are used to draw irrigation water from a source. And last, rice harvester. The rice combined harvester is a four-in-one machine that combines reaping, threshing, cleaning, and bagging operations. That's the end of our lesson 1 for use farm tools and equipment. For more video lessons, don't forget to like and share, subscribe, and hit the bell button. Thank you for watching.